field when they raised peppermint. They waited till the peppermint got about the, oh, you can't see. All right, if this is the ground, peppermint gets about this high. When it's ready to be harvested, it has little pink lavender yeah. type mm -hmm. blossoms on it. Did they tell you that up there? No. No, no but you've maybe, okay, you've maybe seen it. All right, when that happens, it's ready to harvest. Mm -hmm. And so the guys go out, I'm gonna move this for a minute. The guys go out, the farmers go out. They, they cut it down in the old day with a sigh. You know, it's a long thing with a handle and it looks like a question mark here made out of metal. That's how they cut all the plants down. Today we don't do that, do we? What would we use to cut hay or tractors? Right, and a mower. A mower. Okay, so they do that. Then they had to wait for three days. Why do you suppose they had to wait for three days? Because it doesn't grow. No, it doesn't grow again. They've already cut it. Let's let it soak. The, I mean the plant, I mean the part that's already cut. Why do you think they would wait three? Ab, who said that? Who said that? Very good. All right, it's in August when this happens. Hot. So if they let it sit on the ground for three days, the moisture comes out of it. That makes their job easier.